This is a photograph of my father when he was in the United States Army Air Corps. That was during World War II and that was prior to that branch of the service being changed to the United States Air Force. So he spent time in there as a meteorologist. He was in China and Burma and India and uh, he was a weatherman for a flight crew. Uh, time passed, he got out of the service, and then, uh, at one point uh, I was born, and when I turned 11 or 12 years old, he bought me this old Marlin single shot 22 rifle. That was 50 years ago. This rifle has probably not been fired in close to 50 years. So it still works. Uh, it does need to be cleaned because it hasn't been cleaned in 50 years. I made a trip tonight to Walmart and bought a rifle cleaning kit, which I didn't have before. So now I can use this and clean the old rifle up. Uh, there is some surface rust beginning to form on it. I'm going to try to get that cleaned up. Uh, the wood needs a little bit of work on it. I'm going to try to clean that up. And uh, August 31st uh, is his birthday. Uh, he would be 91 years old if he were still with us. So I'm going to try to have uh, have some of it done by then and post another video to show you how it's come along and I'll give you some better close-ups of it to show show the condition right now as you can see I don't know if you can see it very well or not but there is some surface rust forming on there this is the old uh, style that obviously it's it's empty There's nothing nothing in the chamber it's a single shot uh, this has the cocking trigger lever ring that you pull back and uh, that cocks it after you put the shell in. So we're going to, uh, I'll give you a, a look at it as far as the current condition. I spent a lot of time in the basement of our three bedroom house uh, shooting this gun, if you can believe that. My father built me a target out of four by fours. Uh, the target was about two feet square and it was made out of four by fours that he had uh, nailed together and put legs on and set at the far end of the basement of our house and I spent time down in the basement firing 22 shells or 22 uh, bullets at copper pennies that I had stuck on that uh, stuck on that target. I actually got pretty good at hitting a penny at uh, 40 feet or however far that was. So anyway, that's uh, that's the video for tonight, and uh, I'll get to work on this, and we'll see how it comes out. Thanks for watching. That's it. We'll talk to you later. Stay safe.